This tutorial shows the step-by-step -step instructions for this lesson in the Omega Learning Guide. At the end of this lesson, your job should look something like this. To begin, you will need to open the file you saved at the end of the previous lesson. Click File Import. Locate the file lily.jpg in the Learning folder. Turn off Keep Layers and click Import. The Import cursor displays. Click the work surface to import the upper left corner of the image at that location. Select the image and click Shape Absolute Size. Choose Uniform and enter a height of 9, then press the Tab key on the keyboard. The Length text box is automatically updated. Click OK. Click Zoom to All or press Spacebar to see all the elements in the job. With the image still selected, click the Image Fill button on the Toolbox toolbar to open the Image Fill dialog box. In color type, choose Process. Using the sliders, change the thumbnail settings to 24 bits per pixel and high resolution. Make sure the embedded checkbox is selected, then click OK. Using the Selection tool, select the image first, then the inner border of the job, not the outline. When justifying objects, the objects justify to the location of the last selected object. By selecting the image before the border, the image moves to the border location. Click Arrange Justify and click the left and bottom Justify buttons, then click OK. Click View Filled or press F8 to preview the job. Select only the image with the Selection tool. Click Tools Generate Decal Cut. The Decal Cut dialog box will open. Select Clipping Path Only and change the white threshold to More, then click OK. A clipping path appears around the image of the lily. Click View Filled or press F8 to preview the job. Using the Zoom tool, zoom in on the lower portion of the lily image. Select the clipping path with the Selection tool. Select the Delete Point tool from the Detail Edit toolbar. The points in the clipping path display. Using the eraser end of the Delete Points icon, delete the cut lines around the single lily leaf to the left of the image. When you are finished, click the Selection tool to exit Detail Edit. Click View Filled or press F8 to preview the job. Notice that the single lily leaf is no longer part of the clipped image. Click Select Clipping Paths to display the Select Clipping Paths dialog box. Choose Complete Clipping Group and select the ID number in the preview window. Click OK to return to the work surface with the image and clipping path selected. Click Edit Copy, then click Edit Paste. With the duplicate image and clipping path still selected, click Shape in Place Flip X. With the image and clipping path still selected, Hold the Shift key and select the surround border, not the outline. Click Arrange Justify and click the right and bottom Justify buttons, then click OK. Click View Filled or press F8 to preview the job. Remember to save your file when you are finished. This concludes this lesson. Be sure to check if there are any exercises or tip videos associated with this lesson before continuing. For more information on this and other topics, please consult the Omega Help file or press F1 in Composer.